Welcome back to my channel, guys. I am Lady Hellcat, and this is Marvel's Spider-Man. Uh, today we are rocking... Why do I have so many new things available? Today we are rocking the negative suit, which has the negative shockwave uh, ability. And I think it looks kind of weird, but that's okay. We're also going after a main mission today, which is... I have no idea. At your feet. Yeah. That's what we're gonna do. Hidden agenda. Okay, that's a quest, yeah. I forgot there for a second. Three, we have a hostage situation involving a tourist bus. Converge on the east. Hold on. I'm on my way. Oh, isn't that the one where I actually have to do it silently and I never do it silently? Silently. Tranquility and balance are our goals, not bloodshed. When threatened, even the peaceful must defend themselves. Norman Osborne threatens us. He threatens Can I? us all. Osborne's deceit and immorality cannot be protected. Ah, damn it. Oh no, it's that guy. Seriously? Oh man. What are you doing? And why can't I jump? Yep. Ooh, that's cool. Demons are getting more and more brutal. I can't believe Martin Lee is really behind all this. Call my agent. <laughs> and who would that be? Yuri? Uh, what's going on? Ah, yes. His clothes were in the rain. I don't think that's very comfortable, is it? No, it's not. Peter! So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? Just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna... Look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. Hmm. I should check out Lee's office. Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. You say so, ma'am. Hey. I heard you at City Hall for the bombing. You okay? Just a little banged up. How are you doing? Not bad. Your aunt's been helping me with my interview skills. I don't know. I'm not sure I'm cut out for the nine to five. I know I've had my share of career hurdles, but you never know until you try. Give it a shot. 
Well, he sure seems to be helping a lot of people, right? Go to Lee's office, which is upstairs. And optionally, I can help clean up the mess. And that's Today's my dog. Gonna be a good day. In the background, I don't know if you guys can hear that. Oh. <laughs> May kept Uncle Ben's clothes a long time. It's like he was still looking out for her. Hmm. I knew a man who panhandled around City Hall. Still haven't seen him. Okay. So there doesn't seem to be. Hey, glad you're feeling better. I don't feel. People don't realize how many kids are homeless. One in thirty. And too many shelters aren't equipped to care for them. That is bad. Everyone feels hopeless at some point. Helps to know there's somebody willing to listen. Okay. God grant me some strength. Hmm. Oh, more messes. And hanging in there. Thanks. I appreciate it. Oh, that's so sweet. Everyone's worried about him. But it has to be one more, right? Oh. Hmm. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. Okay. There's one over there. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. I never used to feel safe at the other shop. Veteran homelessness is down, this but one, still way too I high. I never had a problem. Good thing my buddy Flash Thompson's doing his best to fix that. There's always someone looking out for us. I heard the deputy mayor was brainwashed. Huh? Yeah, no, we checked those. Okay, so... I didn't find the third thing that I was supposed to clean, but hey. Find a way into the office. It, okay. But nobody saw that. Huh. Never seen that room before. Um. Uh, hold up. There we go. Weird. Whoa, what the... voltage lines. What needs this much power? There. I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. Hmm. Lee's office is the other way. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. Lee's parents. Looks like there's a keyhole in the frame. I thought Lee's parents abandoned him. Why build a shrine to the people who threw you away? Oh, uh, maybe somebody's not telling the whole story. Huh. 
Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Okay. Uh. Well. Looks like this note is for May. Lee's journal. Ooh. Bet this fits the lock in the portrait. Cool. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Anything else? Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. Yeah, well, everyone has a dark side, right? Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. Supposed to be a yin yang. Hold on. With the white on top and the black bottom. Uh, okay. That seems right. I see. Yes. Whoa. What the hell? What are you hiding, Lee? He sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone? He's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? That it? That doesn't sound very good. This is all about Norman Osborn. His whole career. Lee must have been obsessed with him. Lee was keeping tabs on Wilson Fisk too. Trying to predict when he'd fall. There's something specific on this to article is decades old. It must be back when Oscorp was first founded. Oscorp lost a lawsuit about improper clinical trials years ago. Did they cover this up? I've never heard of it. Yeah, that's all. So, what am I missing? Investigate. I did investigate. Oh, I forgot something. Here. Creepy. This 
is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Us? So MJ is officially a part of it. Phew. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. Is there a way that I can stop it? Oh, shit. I don't think it's just... One more. Uh... Ah, there. The police had found this. Or May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. Let me get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Mm. Well, I should right. go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Well, something's definitely up with him, right? Nothing good. Wait, wait, wait! I think you found out, didn't he? Hey, it's sunny again! Ah, oh, I like it. Captain Watanabe. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? It's just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait, remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more, but I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? What's up <sighs> with that? What should I cook? Okay. Uh, I also have a new suit. 
gadgets, and a new skill. What is this one? Throw an object damage damage all nearby. Yeah, that's what I wanted. What should I cook? I have no idea. Give me a mission. Um, here. I should head over there. Reports of men and demons. Oh, hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like now? This is my defining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to have this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. I wonder if this means I have a job again. Yes, I can stop by. Probably. Just for a minute. Was it like an instant takeout? That was actually kind of cool. Better. Demons seem to be gearing up for something big. Uh. Office, right? Let's see what the doc has for us. And the Sutar is already ready. That's not bad at all. Okie dokes then. I totally forgot to use my gadgets. Why? I have no idea. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Yeah, except You've that... You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. Ready? <laughs> Everything okay? This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a- Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. Oh, 
Octavius. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Oh, coffee. That's actually a great idea. I might even do that in a little bit. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Uh. Why are you giving me an alternative route? I don't have two. I could use... Okay, I have minus three and minus four down there. Let's just go with that. And then here I could put in a four. Mm, no. Hold on. Here. Uh, here. And then here. And then... We have a problem. <laughs> what did I just do here? We could change something. Or can we? As if I really go this way. Oh, hold up. Let me go this way. Uh, there's a reason. There's always a reason for everything, so... Yeah, which exactly at this moment is... Having too much energy. And I cannot remove these. I could install a minus three. This has to be this. And this. If I put this one here. Even if I put in a minus four, it's not going to work. So, what is the alternative? Maybe the alternative really is what I was trying to do. Uh, would be rerouting this. Hey! I don't know what to do here. Okay, let's just say this actually works. There we go. What do you want from me? You want to go have dinner? Really? Hmm, good boy.
Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? Yeah, Octavius, are you sick? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? That is true, To changing Peter. the world. <laughs> that is actually pretty awesome. Missed call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Absolutely. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, don't forget to drop a like, comment, and subscribe to stay tuned on future content. I would really appreciate it. It's really going to help us the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!